There we go. Ready? Hello and welcome to the Mara School. We are Lottie, Claudia and Grace. We made this film to tell you about what we love about the Sprout Pro. So what really is the Sprout? Sprout is an all-in-one, digital, immersive piece of technology that we've been using at school and in our homes. And we want to show you about how we would use Sprout to teach, learn and create. We hope you enjoy our film. This is Miss Stewart, head of Key Stage 2, and she has been using Sprout as a teaching tool. Can you tell me how Sprout has enhanced learning? Sprout has been invaluable for our kinesthetic and visual learners. You can move between videos, images, pictures very, very easily. Being able to have dual images, a video playing with information next to it as well is great for the girls. Having it as an all-in-one PC where you don't have to add on any extra devices, it's a great tool to have in the classroom. Hello Ms. Tuman. How is Sprout being used in design technology? We're using it at all different stages of the design process. So we're using it in the initial stages to create mood boards by capturing students' actual photographs. We can even scan in actual objects like fabrics and they can bring those directly into their mood board and create one image. It allows us to scan an image in 3D and then print out into a 3D format as well as bring computer-aided manufacturing to life which is essential in our new specification. That's great, thank you. Thank you, Grace. <laughs> the pupils have been doing exciting things in their art class. Let's go and see how they're using Sprout in their current animation projects. So what was it like when you first encountered Sprout? Well, we thought it was a really cool new piece of technology. And it looked really, really fun and exciting. What yeah. was it like when you used Sprout to make your animation? At the start, you had to get used to all the buttons, but it became really easy and fun to do. Yeah. Have you developed any skills whilst using Sprout? Definitely become more creative and obviously improved our animation skills. I'm here with Annabelle and Emmy from Sixth Form, and they're going to show us how they use Sprout. Hey guys. Hi. Hi. <laughs> We're just working on our APQs. What's an EPQ? It's basically a research project that counts as an AS grade and you can either do an essay or an artefact as Annabelle's doing where you make something and then write a shorter dissertation on it. So I can scan in some of the pages I've got in this book and put them all together on this one document where I can annotate it and then come up with a design criteria for my final piece. Hi girls. I was completely blown away with your enterprise project and I really just wanted to use this as an opportunity to find out what you did and why you used Sprout. It's a portable coffee holder that is simple, easy and cheap. This is Cup of Coffee, our own original design that we created on Sprout and then 3D printed. We even took it to the Macs and built our own website. I'm really, really blown away by what you've achieved, so well done. Thank you. Thank you. Hi Miss Walsh, I was wondering if you could tell me how Sprout is helping you create marketing materials for the school. I'm working on the new pupil prospectus. I'm sure you got one of these when you joined the school. Yeah. We've got the new frog learning platform, so I'm able to scan in things like the frog key ring. And then as you can see here, I was able to bring them instantly into the document with no cutting out. So it saves me time and allows me to be more creative. I went to go and interview our principal to see what he thinks about Sprout and how he thinks it can help us teach, learn and create. Would you like to take a seat? You've been a huge supporter of Sprout and you've really encouraged us to use it. This is a product which squares nicely with a strategic priority we have to address a significant issue of concern nationally and that is the number of women who are in STEM industries. That is something we hope to change significantly so that girls would move from our classroom settings, be it in art or textiles or technology or science or maths, in whatever application, and look to smash through that class ceiling and give better opportunities. Thank you. Well, that's a 
wrap. We hope you've enjoyed watching our film as much as we've enjoyed making it. We hope we've given you some new ideas on how to use the sprout, but as you know, the possibilities are endless. This is how we've been using sprout today. Who knows how we'll be using it tomorrow.